global effort has begun. Secret files hidden from the public for decades detailing every UFO account are now available to the public. We are about to uncover the truth behind these unclassified documents. Find out what the government doesn't want you to know. Unsealed. Potboy Files. Uncovering the biggest secret on planet Earth. Hey Tubers, it's Potboys live from the internet. Today we're turning our attention towards the planet Saturn. NASA engineer Norman Berggren has recently come out warning that living alien UFO spaceships are proliferating on Saturn's rings. It's actually come out to say that the, the giant alien UFOs are hiding within Saturn's rings. Berggren, of course, a distinguished and highly respected former NASA researcher who held top positions at NASA's Ames Research Center, believes that giant living alien UFO spaceships are in fact proliferating at a tremendous rate within the rings of Saturn. Berggren claims that the rate of proliferation of the alleged giant living alien UFO spaceships on the rings of Saturn has been increasing with time and has reached a critical level. Berggren, again a distinguished former NASA research engineer who has made major innovative contributions to multiple US aeronautic, missile and rocket programs, has also won many top science and engineering awards, including the California Society of Professional Engineers Archimedes Engineering Achievement Award. Many UFO researchers and enthusiasts claim that Bergen's revelations blew the lid on one of NASA's most closely guarded secrets, that technologically advanced alien species are exploring our solar system at this moment. In a book he published in 1986 titled Ringmakers of Saturn, Bergen claimed that he first detected the presence of intelligent extraterrestrial beings exploring our solar system on Saturn's rings. According to Berggren, the spaceships parked on Saturn's rings by alien explorers are living alien UFO spaceships. The living alien UFO spaceships are using the rings of Saturn as hiding spots, and they are proliferating on the rings of the gas giant at an increasingly rapid rate. He claimed that the alien UFO spacecraft are proliferating faster and faster with time, and warned that they could be a threat to human civilization. He warned some years ago that the number of the alien UFO ships on Saturn's rings has reached a critical level, warning that NASA and the US authorities should keep an eye on what he believes to be an alien activity on Saturn that could spread across our solar system and potentially threaten human civilization. Bergen claimed that after the population of the alleged living alien spaceships on Saturn's rings reached a critical level, the aliens began moving them to other gas giant planets such as Jupiter, Neptune, and Uranus. What I found was, these things inhabit Saturn, that's where I first discovered them, and they're proliferating. You can find them around Uranus and Jupiter, wherever you see some rings, that's where I see them. I call them a ring maker. It was a quote from Berggren himself. The aliens allegedly exploring our solar system are using the rings of Saturn as a source of energy to power their UFOs. He explained that the UFOs are living because they are autonomous and capable of carrying out the defining functions of biological systems, such as self-reproduction. Many UFO researchers and enthusiasts believe that NASA knows that Berggren's claims are true but the agency is covering up the truth that our solar system is being explored by technologically advanced alien species in highly sophisticated alien spacecraft. The technologically advanced extraterrestrial beings are exploring our solar system using living UFOs that are able to blend with the natural cosmic environment. The ability of the living spacecraft to blend with the natural environment makes it very difficult to detect them. UFO researchers believe that Norman Berggren saw top secret NASA images during the time that he served on the National Advisory Committee for Aeronautics and worked with Lockheed Martin on highly classified aerospace projects. His conclusions, according to UFO researchers, are based on the evidence he gathered from the images. 
So guys, let me know what you think of the uh, of these claims coming from this former NASA engineer. Please like the video, subscribe and share, and thanks for watching, we'll talk to you next time.